The chairman of the Tobago Division of Trinidad and the Tobago Chamber of Industry and Commerce says he does not expect Tobago to get its requested $5.239 billion in the national budget to be presented on Friday. He hopes that the finance minister, Colm Imbert, puts serious measures in place to assist in diversifying Tobago's economy. Here again is Patricia Nicholson. Chair of the Tobago Arm of the Trinidad and Tobago Chamber, Demi John Cruikshank, noted that Tobago has the potential to contribute significantly to the country's economy. He hopes that Friday's budget presentation would include plans to seriously diversify the island's economy. But he doesn't expect Tobago to receive upwards of $5 billion. If you look at what the, the Minister of Finance has indicated, he has indicated that we, the budget will be cut by approximately $10 billion, which will go down to approximately $53 billion. So I'm not, I'm not optimistic that we will get $5 billion at all. Uh, we will probably get two, between 2 or $2.2 .2 billion uh, around that for, out of the national budget. He said there is no need for the THA to cut back on its spending in any particular sector, but thinks the resources could be better managed. Mr. Kirkshank pointed to the number of workers employed by the THA and said these workers go to work daily without any idea of the way forward for their respective divisions and are highly unproductive as a result. You need to have a structured plan from the assembly as the employer for the workers and say, listen, this is how we're going to proceed on a day-to-day -day basis. And that is the problem with the Tobago. The Tobago's of assembly don't have to really cut back, you know. What they have to do is manage and manage the affairs of the assembly efficiently and effectively. As for the tourism sector, he said the ANR International Airport needs to be redone. He also said the Sandals project is fully welcomed by the Tobago Chamber. We welcome investments such as Sandals to come into the market, to change the mindset of the Tobagonian, to train, change the people, to say, listen, this is how we, because we have a gold mine. Our product in Tobago is far superior to any of the other Caribbean islands. But the Caribbean islands are doing a lot better than us because they understand what this product to be, tourism is all about. I'm Patricia Nicholson for C News. As the country prepares for the presentation of the national budget on Friday, Tobagonians tell CNews what their expectations are, particularly for Tobago. My belief is that it will have something good for Tobago because Tobagonians suffer for a very long time. And I believe now it's time they should start inheriting whatever is have for them. He does not think the Tobago House of Assembly would get $5 billion. No, they will never get that. They wouldn't get that. But they will get something good. They should talk about plenty diversification in the economy. Because we all already know that the oil price is not, is not going up. It's just go, keep going down, right? So we are keep on going into deficit. And, and that is not becoming the main income of the country. And a place like Tobago, which is our main tourism island, Unlike, unlike Trinidad, which is an industrial place, right? I think that they should, they should more focus on trying to diversify within agriculture and tourism. Because of the financial situation that we are in, we expect, I don't believe that anybody's going to believe that they're going to get um, a big budget. But whatsoever we get, we are going to hope that we in Tobago is going to use it to the best of our abilities. They have to remember the poor class of people, right? All the poor people that don't know what, how to budget them, how to tax them. If they have a little business and it's not working well, will you tax those same people? Hopefully, the, um, the mode of operation would be that good sense will prevail and good spending would happen in Tobago, eh, despite the amount that we actually get. But I actually doubt, I really doubt that we might get that amount.